Okay, here is a follow up video on uh, how I'm using reading list in Safari on both iPad, iPhone, and Mac. This is on my Mac, Safari on my Mac. You see the icon to open the add to reading list, last list in Swedish. I click add, leg till, add to reading list. And then <coughs> the button to open the reading list, last lista, is this button. Click on it and you see a list with all the articles that I have saved for reading at a later time. So let's say we want to read this article, I click on it, it loads in into the browser with all the stuff around the article that we don't want to read, the sidebar, logos and more. So we click on the reader button, Läsare in Swedish, and then the article opens very beautiful formatted very easy to read very beautiful as you can see click on the reading button again and the article is normal again very easy so how do you get those two buttons in the toolbar in Safari if you're not having them there. Then you need to open Customize Toolbar on Passaverktidsfältet in Swedish. And there you have the buttons. So drag and drop them to the toolbar and you have them. You can do that with many things if you install extension and so on. So that's it.